All right, here we go. So we're at the Space Center, and uh, we're here with the TF-104 uh, two-seater. There's uh, Sean, Director of Maintenance, uh, our AJ and Andrew here. We have uh, just finished at uh, inspection on the hydraulic system, and uh, there's an opportunity to see some of the system open up uh, that rarely has been seen before. Um, so what we're having here, uh, we're testing, and there's AJ on the back seat. Uh, uh, Sean is here. That's one of the two uh, angle of attack probes, which we talk extensively um, in other videos. We're gonna see if, uh, if uh, Sean moves it a little bit forward. Go ahead, Sean. And so increases the angle of attack, as you see. We're gonna see this index here coming up, as you see now. Now around four, 4.5, you would get the shaker and then at five, the kicker. Uh, I'm gonna ask AJ to move the flight controls back and forth. We're gonna see, and the aircraft obviously has hydraulic and electric now. So you see the two actuators from the two different systems there. And those are the flight controls coming there. Those are the actuators, several actuators. Two cylinders, one per system. And you see the whole movement. Now, on the bottom there, you see there's a fork. That fork is the kicker. So we're gonna see what that does. Can you do the kicker? You see what happened? One more. So what that does, uh, it basically pushes the stick forward and that reduces the angle of attack. That's a system that the aircraft feels you're going beyond the angle of attack. It doesn't want you to stall and it helps you pushing the stick forward. Uh, can you do it one more time? So we're gonna see what it looks like from here. You're gonna see this going to five or close to it and you're gonna see the stick moving forward. Three, four, that's it. And then you can overpower it, go for it. Here there's a paddle switch in front that if you push it, you, ne you uh, cut out the system. You see now it's working. Otherwise, if I let go, it goes forward. That's a lot, that allows uh, basically to keep flying if the, if the system fails, it allows you to actually overpower it and hold the stick where it's supposed to be uh, kept. That's the three motor moving. That's a good uh, chance to see the three motor moving. Now, this system here, is containing a very, very small space, very, very uh, thin, obviously, the, like every other surface. So for the complexity of the system, it was called the Cadillac because that whole system there used to cost like a whole Cadillac at that time when, the, you know, we're talking in the, on the 60, obviously. So that's called the Cadillac assembly. And it's funny now that you see through it, basically, because uh, the panels are taken off. All right, that's it for today. I hope. Uh, Hopefully you like it and uh, remember to subscribe if you think uh, these videos are interesting.